All right, so we got an upcoming Sutter Online game, guys. Will this game actually be good? Well, let's talk about that in this video. First of all, if you enjoyed this video, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that like button. I'd really appreciate it. Let me also say that this game is in like alpha. It's not ready. We are able to test it, but a lot of stuff in the game can be changed, probably will be changed, and there will be a lot of things that still needs to be added and updated into the game. So for the most part, we're just kind of getting a gist of how the game is. But without further ado, let's get right into the game. As you can see, this is how the game is looking. I don't, I'm not gonna put any volume, any of the volume up because uh i the music i can't take the music off so i'm gonna just keep it all off you can't hear any sound effects that's tough but it is what it is but yeah first of all let me just say that the game looks really good I, like how you guys feel about this it's not the blocky style that they're going with like for example the trees look at the trees they look really good but yeah no so this game looks different from a lot of the gpo style pretty much i don't know what i'm talking about it's just you know it's good it's refreshing it's refreshing but yeah the game is very looks very different it's got like a pink bluish effect to the world like if y'all look in the distance y'all could see like a kind of pinkish fog kind of y'all see it's especially when we start to leave the town yeah no y'all i know y'all looking at this area and saying whoa this game looks good yeah no this game definitely looks good this is like the best this has got to be the best starter town in any seo game i've ever played Let's just go over the skills real quick because we only got like one skill really, which is the third skill. We press uh, three and hold it down. We're gonna hold down this skill and let go of it, which is an attack. You could also just, you don't even have to hold it down. You can just press it and it'll instant activate. We'll wait until the cooldown is up and we'll press it again. So press three, press it, don't even hold it and boom. Yeah, that's the only skill that we have right now. If you press N also, you could use your uh, menu, but you have to put your sword away and then press N. And the cool thing is other people who are around you could actually see you do everything that you're doing in your menu. Everything that you see, they could see. So it's pretty cool. Your health is also at the side. Hold on. I like that. Like everybody could see your health is at the side of your uh, your character. But yeah, in your menu, you could you could do all types of things. Go to your items, skill, equipment, uh, party, friends, guilds, everything that you need, messages, all this stuff is in here. Somebody could invite you to a battle because you can't just randomly hit somebody. They can invite you to a duel, which should be somewhere in here, right? Uh, equipment. Yeah, well, they can invite you to a duel. I don't remember how to do it, but maybe it's like in here. Yep, there it is. And you get the notification. So even if you know, you're know you not in your menu, you'll get like the notification at the bottom of your screen where it says, this is the alpha, which by the way, this is alpha. So gameplay is subject to change, keep that in mind. But yeah, it'll see it somewhere down there. You'll open up your menu and you'll see like a red notification telling you somebody wants to duel you. Pretty sure they have to be around you for that to work though, but yeah. Anyways, let's leave the town real quick because this map looks pretty good. This is also the sword, by the way, that I'm using. <laughs> so I'm, I, I don't know how common this is. I'm pretty positive. You're not going to just spawn in the game with the sword. But yeah, here's some M1s if y'all want to see it. I will say that the M1s feel, the M1s feel fine to me um it's more so as of the movement i don't feel like the movement is as fluid as i would like and i'm sure they will change that and make it better but the movement when fighting is not as fluid and it just doesn't look as good but the m1s look fine all right so this is how it looks when you leave the town look at this now this is what i mean by that pinkish blue like y'all can see the little blue fog we're well, not blue fog but it just see it has like blue effect and then in the distance it's pink it's really colorful, the trees, the grass, everything's really colorful, I really like it. So yeah, no, we're, we're moving outside the town, and there's another town out, actually outside. This is floor one, by the way. All this is, is floor one. And that's all y'all gonna be seeing for this video. There's like a little, a little thing, I think. You have to go there to go up to the next floor. We're gonna head down that way, but we're gonna try to stop at the other town first. I don't wanna show too much of nighttime footage because I ain't gonna lie, I just, I, I don't like recording during the night. Like, you can barely see my character, bro. I hate it when it's so dark that you can't even see my character. But yeah, here it is. Here's the next town over here. Um, ooh, dummies. Wait a minute. Hold on. Oh, can't hit them. Thanks. All right. Well, here's the next town. It's a really small town. It's not a huge town. They still do have to add NPCs. They still do have to add, and they will have NPCs just randomly around the place. They have to add um, just the things around the, the town to give it more life. This is pretty much not a base plate. This is just the map, but nothing added to the map, by the way. So <laughs> that's why it feels empty. Yeah, no, here's more of the map over here. 
I don't know if you'll be able to go inside these buildings. I sure hope you will be. Um, a little campfire over here. This looks like a teleportation area. So you might be able to teleport to this uh, town right from over here, which is pretty, pretty cool. Oh, you see, this is perfect. This is how you can see the pinkest fog, bro. The pinkest fog. I don't think I've ever played a game of Roblox that has this type of world effect. And this is how you get to the next floor, I believe, because this is that one pillar. So we're gonna go over to this dungeon, the dungeon, and check it out. And here it is, we cannot go inside of it, but this is the last little location y'all really need to see. This is, I believe, how you're gonna be going to each and every floor. I wonder how they're gonna do the dungeon system. I am very curious. There's also like a little bridge area at the side over here, actually, as you can see. But yeah, this that's the map so far. Let me know how y'all feel about it. Yeah, let me know how y'all feel about this map down in the comments below. You also do spawn in with your normal Roblox character for the most part. I mean, yeah, I got the same hair. I got my headband and my same face, my Roblox character. I even got some accessories that I wish wasn't there for this game, but it is what it is. Now there is one more thing I wanna show you guys. This is what happens when you hop in the game. So we're gonna put our headphones on for this because this is a whole cutscene that we're gonna be watching. And let's put up the volume. All right, here's the cutscene. So we're gonna we're gonna choose male, of course, and continue. You could skip the cutscene, but we're not gonna do that. There's my character. There's my character looking like looking like me. Look at all the posters around the Hitman Reborn post in the background. Yes, sir. One of the best animes. Or one of my favorite. Yeah, this 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 crap is clean to me. I really think it was clean, and then it transitions to this little start screen over here. Y'all gonna see in a minute. Yep, this right here. Anyways, that's it for this video. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this game down in the comments below. Uh, this game is in early alpha, so it's pretty empty. And there's a lot of stuff that's not in the game. A lot of skills that I was not able to show you. A lot of weapons, armor, a whole lot of stuff. But this is pretty much kind of like the... To give y'all kind of a hint of how the game looks. But I'll see y'all in the next video. And peace out.